everyone welcome to dress my craft design team member jayshree this side today i am sharing with you all a process tutorial on how to make a scrapbook layout using the beautiful sweet treats paper pack and different circle punches but before we get started do subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos to begin with i have here the beautiful sweet treats paper pack as always the paper pack has 12 designs and this paper pack is perfect for making birthday projects i have selected the design with kind of watercolor bubbles on it it matches perfectly with the focal image i have chosen for the layer i am beginning by prepping the paper with clear gesso i am using a palette knife to add the clear gesso you may also use a paint brush or a silicon brush as per the availability You may also skip this step in case you don't plan on adding any water or paint on your paper. Now I have here scalloped circle punches from Dress My Craft in the sizes 2.5 inch, 1.5 inch and 1.25 inch. I also have here a circle punch in the size 2 inch. I have pre-punched out some heavy weight card stocks in different colors matching the base colors on the paper. I am now aligning them to make a formation behind the focal image. Let me show you how easy it is to punch with these. You just need to place your card stock in the opening of the punch and simply press. You may punch up to 300 GSM card stock with these punches easily. simply going to form a design using these punched out circles and adhere them using liquid glue i am also using some thick cardboard used in packaging behind certain circles to elevate them and give a dimensional look you may also use two three layers of double sided tape in case you don't have a thick chipboard While I arrange all the circles why don't you give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying watching this tutorial also the list of supplies used in this tutorial is given in the description box below so do check that out I am now going to use fussy cut out elements from the motif sheet as well as pattern paper to embellish the layout.
also using some vintage lace around the edge of the image for embellishing. Next, I am using the very cute shaker slices in different shapes. I am using the ice cream candies, carnival candies and sweet candies along with some hug me sequins from Dress My Craft. These shaker slices are so cute and perfect for embellishing as well as using them as shaker elements. I am simply adhering them with liquid glue randomly here and there to fill some spaces. I am mixing them all together to give them a very nice birthday treats kind of a look. Lastly, I am enhancing the balloon elements with glossy accents and sprinkling some microfine glitter from Dress My Craft on it. enjoyed watching this tutorial and are all set to make your own scrapbook layouts using different punches and shaker slices from Dress My Craft. Please do give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel before you go. Until next time, happy crafting. Bye bye.